Welcome back to Among the Sleep. My quest for dominion over the nether realm continues. Oh great, it's Arkham Manor. I just finished playing Arkham Asylum, so... <laughs> Replaying, I should say. Mm-hmm. So far, nothing's killed me yet. I disagree. So far, nothing's really killed me. So I'm guessing this game is more puzzle-oriented than combat-oriented. I mean, are you surprised? But... <laughs> I mean, so far there's been no threats other than just the possibility of me jump- of something jumping on and scaring me. Perhaps that's some sort of deeper analysis of how there are no real threats to childhood, only fear. We have nothing to fear but fear itself. Those floaty things, they look like memories. Maybe the next one is behind those roots. What's this? Oh, uh, oh! Ah, a puzzle. We have, so I need to get more pieces, three pieces. And the next memory is behind that puzzle. I'll bite. Oh, I saw something up there. Puzzle piece. Okay. Interesting. Not really, but whatever. Uh huh. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. There are puzzle pieces, and th this will get rid of the roots. That's what the game was talking about. Okay. Ah, maybe p one piece by piece we'll start getting rid of the roots. Let's see here. Um. Yes! Ah, I am smart. I got a big brain. It's an awful blue water there. Whoa! <laughs> cool. And here we go. Saving. Why? Why is it saving? Is there any danger of me dropping off a cliff, or of Satan stabbing me randomly? Why bother saving? Are you just worried that I'll get bored and quit the game? It's very possible that could happen. Proceed on your way to oblivion. Fucking wind chimes, man. Um, well, it's a drawer. No idea what's in it. No way to get it. I'll move on. How oh, great is this the part where Killer Croc comes out? Tick. Talk, tick, talk. Time to feed the cock. I can't read that high. I hear like moaning and stuff from the lake or something. Is this where the ending of Psycho happened? What the heck? Okay. Ah, yes, here we are. And up. These are like drawers, but they have like roots in them or something. And here we go. This revealing some sort of deeper psychoanalysis of the What's that? Well I'll know what it is if it kills me. Mm. 
Wait, let me guess, it's all in a dream, isn't it? Because I'm a two-year-old with a very active imagination. Aww. But I had such potential for Game of Thrones references. But you extinguished it. You get nothing, then. Slenderman? <laughs> Australia! Of course! Australia is behind it all. Here. Hello. Well, I guess I'll move on then. Whoa. That is the creepiest looking snail in history. What? What kind of car is this? A fish car? Is that what this is all about? Ah. Uh. For the night is dark and full of terrors. There, you got it. And yes, a piece. An airplane! Okay, I broke it. Okay. Alright, now I need to get back to the mainland. Whoa! What is even happening here? What? <laughs> what the? That I can't crouch on there. What is? What? I. Oh, okay. Here we are. Ultimately, it all comes down to. What? Ultimately, it all comes down to pulling up more cupboard drawers. That's the meaning of life. Ew! Oh my god! I actually drowned! Ugh, pacifier. Okay, well did I at least get the puzzle piece? Ugh! Wow, worst hangover. Okay. Well, okay, so you can die by uh, pitfall. Good to know. Now what? Ah, okay, that's what I should have done. It's so simple. A baby can do it. Don't care. Hmm? Uh. Is that my fake parents laughing or arguing? That's totally the sound of laughter. Okay, we have established that I can somehow die. So there are consequences to failure. So there are threats to my livelihood. Or at least my sanity, if this is all still a dream world or whatever. Okay, let's put another uh, puzzle piece here. This place feels... <clears throat> let's not dwell here for too long. Yeah, it's getting pretty lame. Kidding. All right, enter another portrait. Okay.
So I'm now starting to wonder, like, what the... What's this all about? What, a, what is even going on here? Obviously it's a dream. Because the game's called Among the Sleep. But what am I looking at here? We've already established Satan. That's not the Iron Throne. We've already established Satan as a thing. A menorah and a turtle in a box next to a tree. Okay. Sorry, a dreidel. I got... I don't even know what... <laughs> Never mind. It's not a menorah. What? Or, I... I don't even remember. I'm just spout... I'm just saying words, because... I don't know. I don't know, but... Ah. Uh, okay, now I'm scared. Oh god, it's Sawyer's backstory from Lost. His parents killed each other and then they shot the... Okay. Ah! Smells! Athlete's foot. Okay. Oh God, they're having sex above me. That's why they're taking their shoes off. Next thing I see, panties or something flying about. Like I, I need to stop putting plugs of my own of past Let's Play series in. Uh huh. Okay. On the other hand, since it is a dream, they can't just throw stuff at me without rhyme or reason. Therefore making jump scares all the more unexpected. Sounds like someone's having a good night. Ah! Nice meeting ya. There's nothing you can do to stop me from going through this door. Open this goddamn door! As Sawyer would say. You seem to kind of have a, a hole under your bed. Guess I'll go right in. Well, that was definitely a noise. Probably a puzzle piece down in the well. Turn. Turn. It's righty tidy lefty loosey, right? I pull it up, it's my dead brother. Walt's severed head. <laughs> That's a joke my brother and I always used to make. Oh, there's another thing in here. That's a joke my brother and I always used to say when we were watching Lost. We'd be like, you know, like every time they're like about to open a coffin or something and pull up some... What did I get? I got a key. I got a key and a puzzle piece. Hmm. Anyway, my brother and I would always joke like when we were watching Lost, like, 
if they're about to like open a box or pull open a coffin or whatever. We we go like yeah, like what's in the box? And we're like, it's Walt's severed head. <laughs> that would be the closing of the storyline there. I'm guessing maybe I should put this back. It's still glowing and all that, so who knows? Or maybe I'm supposed to put something in there and drown it. Because that would be, you know, messed up thing to do. And here's where the key goes. Put the triangle in the triangle shape. Oh. Well, okay then. Yes. What is your favorite color? I don't know why I said that. <laughs> mm. Well, okay. You have fun with that. I'm moving on. We're moving right along. Well, I guess I'll go here. All of a sudden, Killer Croc pops out. Plays the dramatic music. these for <sighs> what now oh booze wonderful <laughs> that's totally the sound that did my parents break out because one was alcoholic Is that what this is going up? This, this is all going. Well, maybe I need to get on top of these. It's usually what it is, platforming, puzzles, getting on top of things and doing things. Ah, here we are. And here's the jump scare. Why are these boards glowing? Up, oh, some fell in the water. Why are they glowing? Maybe keeping the light on the teddy will keep the monsters from go- make them go away? I don't know. Ugh, come on, let's move it. Let's keep going faster, faster. Okay, there. So that's not the right way. Perhaps I need to go... Oh. Must be awful stressful on a young boy's body to be... Going through all this, I'm probably catching a cold or something. <laughs> I demand you go faster. Uh, let's try here. No, I've already been there. Hello. Yes. Okay, so I actually can die. Good to know. Okay, so I don't go to the right, I go to the left. How did that even happen? That didn't happen this time.
quickly now. I have a feeling jump scares about to Oh shit! Well, how do I stop that then? With Teddy? Maybe I have to stealth past it. So, does that thing pop up just for that scene? I'm trying to figure out this this game's game. What it's what 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 are we playing at here? Oh, I can just open it now. Because I've already opened the door. Okay, well. Teddy, protect me. Move faster. It's right behind me, isn't it? Protect me, Teddy. Come on. It's right behind me. And... Oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Okay, good job. Get that final puzzle piece in place. Come on. We made it. So, what are the odds that something's gonna jump out right now? I'm not a little girl, right? Wait. Did the color on my clothes change to green? Or maybe it was just reflecting light. Floaty. Let's see here. All alone. Oh, blood stains. Well, now what? <laughs> nope. Teddy, protect me. You can't you can't kill me while I have Teddy. Okay, you can. Well, all right then. Okay. Then I suppose I'll have to find another way around. But we will have to save that for next time. Yeah, that's it for this session. Um, I don't know what to think. I had just played uh, Fire Sky, which was also a very short game. It was only like two hours long, so I'm still feeling a little bit of a, of a bite from short indie games. Um, so I'm hoping, or maybe it ends after after I return the fourth memory or whatever, but I'm not sure, but we'll, we'll see. Um, I, I think this is the kind of game where I don't, where I don't think I should make up my mind about it until it's over. So, but we'll see what that is like next time on Among the Sleep. Tick-tock, be the croc.